boy. In go. I am ready to go if you are. Mm -hmm. I was intending to stop. Protect yourself right. Follow me. Yes. Let us go. I'll talk on the way. Uh huh. Uh. Okay. Buying, selling fine jewelry here. <sighs> okay. We'll spend the night here, and then we have to go. Crap. Where are we going? Um. Wow. On second thought, let us take a carriage up to Windhelm. I know you hate it there, but this one has some things to do. Gemstones over here. Wow. See why you love it here, it's very pretty. We're just going to go around this way. This looks suspicious and I don't care! I... I probably should sell off some of the junk I'm carrying, but I also don't care about that. Okay. I will... Disrespect the law and you disrespect me. Of course. No. Whoa! Sorry, I'm afraid I can't help you much right now. Currently in mourning. That's okay, I was just admiring the weather. I was actually admiring the weather. I will tell you about what's going on while we're on the way. But uh, there's some stuff going on. And we can sleep in the cart besides. Hello! Mr. Uh. You got Need a ride? Mm hmm. Where do you want to go? Uh, this one would like to go to Windhelm. Climb and back, and we'll be off. It's not like to go to Windhelm, but you go get Frost. I'll wait. Oh, there once was a hero named Ragnar the Red who came riding to right run from all Rorik's dead. <laughs> Let me give you some room. No, that's okay. Okay. Come with me. Do you want to talk? Eh. Uh, uh, kind of. Okay. Let us get back to it. Oof. I just need her coat. There we go. Oh, this is that. What? Get the right butcher. Uh, okay. So we're not going to stay there. Uh, I thought there was a place just south of here, but uh, I don't know. I could be wrong. Let's find out. Yee. This one does not want to stay in Windhelm because that is terrifying. It is cold and snowy and this one does not like it. Mm. Here we go. Are you okay? Okay. 
This one could have sworn that there's a town somewhere up here. We've seen it. Ah. Well, by town I mean house, apparently. An inn, I hope. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Well, come on in. We got warm food, warm drinks, and warm beds. Ah, uh -huh. you need a. How are you doing, my friend? I'm good. How are you? Sure. Okay. You want to relax here? You need Why to not? Care Let me know when you are ready to move she on. Yeah. She said you threw her into a goat pen yesterday. What? Because she was being stupid. Don't make me bring your father into this. Need something? <laughs> Interesting. Uh, hello. If you bring me, you're welcome here. Ah, even if you don't, you're still. There welcome. is some good news, though. Did you see my husband I already? Think the borders I'm of the sorry. shrine may be smaller than we think. Rough at times. No. All this talk so of dragons we'll is making people antsy. Nonsense. Are you well, that's just more it. If you're feeling charitable, buy the Nord a mead. He's good for it. Uh, who is this guy right here? The Nords. Yeah, sure, have to be Drink for the thirsty, food point. for the hungry. Gamma, uh, he's got some real interesting eyes, Kynes though. Grove. Mead, right? That stand of trees is Kynes Grove. You don't honestly think you can just cut some down. What the heck are they arguing about? Anyway, I, I would like to rent a room for myself and my friend over there. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Thank you. He has very interesting eyes. Well, That's we have creepy. to cut down something. I'll show you to your room. Maybe right we should way. just admit that this is uh, a horrible I visited place the meaderies of Riften once as a lad. Oh, wish I had their skill. Oh, you must be older than I thought. Working I mean, our mine is else. dangerous work, but Dravnia keeps it going. Well, Dravnia and the promise of more meat. <laughs> uh, I bought you one, but the, I think she's got it stowed somewhere. All right then. Mm -hmm. Well, this is really quite a nice town when you get down to it. Just you look know. at the view. I got the room. Shall we take a seat or are we leaving? You can take a seat. I'm going to rest here while the storm passes. You know where I am. Do not forget about me, please. I will not. Mm. Yes. Got some nice, comfy beds at the mm. Braidwood Inn if you're looking to flop down somewhere. He has eyes like... You know who he reminds me of? He reminds me of Einar. Who was one of the... One of the bandits that used to work with me and... And Mr. Inga. Einar had kind of sad eyes like that. I'm not entirely sure what happened to him. He kind of left right after Khajiit got there, so... Eh. <laughs> Good morning. I'm still carrying around the door of him, Butler. Why am I doing that? Why am I looking at my potion? I need... Please. Some veggies and some cheese. Good idea. Okay. In go. What are you doing behind the counter? Yes, my friend. Uh, what exactly are you thinking right now? I'm thinking that it is colder outside than it is in here. <laughs> I mean that is true, but uh... okay. Are you going to join me? Take a seat. Nope. I some business to attend to. If I need your help, I know how to summon you. But I think I'll be fine. Where did the guy with the sad eyes go? Anyway. I hope you'll stay for a bit. We could certainly use the business. Uh, well, Inigo will be plenty of business and hopefully well behaved business. What do you business. want, mm. I'll be back. Shouldn't take too long. I hope. Well, it's still snowing, but at least it isn't doing 
what it was doing. Ugh. Now we need to find a way... There. I suppose I should probably just go around Riften. Riften! Riften. Because... Yeah, I don't want to go through it. Hmm. That dude with the set. What was his name? Raggy? Raggy, yes. With the knotted beard. He actually kind of reminds me of Ingrath too, and I don't really know why. I think it's the eyes, actually. Yes, I do. Ingrath has sad eyes too. I don't really know how he got them. His eyes. Well, I know how he lost one of them. <laughs> oh, I shouldn't laugh about that. It's not really a laughing thing. Okay. What is going to be called? What? It will definitely be faster than trying to... Faster and probably safer than trying to go through Wy uh, Winhelm. Especially since uh, Khajiit may have a target on her back now. Yeet. <laughs> oh no! Ah. Looking to hire a boat? Ah, uh, no. Okay. Oh, this one is cold. Hi. Hey, you're the one who killed Elaine Dufont up in Ralbethar. Oh yeah, word about that got around. Man with a piece of bandit trash. That's what I hear. Yeah, that's very true. <laughs> if you don't mind, Kashi has to scramble because she's cold and she needs to move. <laughs> Oops, excuse me, birds. Ah. Oh. <laughs> what? Barker. <sighs> okay, 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 okay. I would have brought Indigo with me, but something tells me. Uh. Mercer would not like that very much. He strikes me as the kind of person who, if I bring unexpected company, he might get a little bit testy. Kashi does know many of those people. At least she sings better than the, uh... Oh, there's a shrine. At least they sing better than the, uh, cart driver. He was kind of... Not great. What am I going? Okay. Supposedly there's a road up here somewhere. Dawn over Windhelm. Look at that. Very pretty indeed. Uh, that looks alright. That looks like the right spot. It is kind of off the road. There's not as there. That's my gun. Yes, this one she thinks. No, no, no. This one thinks she may have found it. Ooh, that looks like foreboding weather to me. Blech. And that is a dead horse. Ooh. Ooh, I see. Okay. 
Okay. I'm here. Good. You're finally here. Mm -hmm. I've scouted the ruins and I'm certain Carlia is still inside. Oh dear. Did you see her? No, I found her horse. Oh. Don't worry, I've taken care of it. She won't be using it to escape. You could have just... Let's get moving. Mm -hmm. I want to catch her inside while she's distracted. Take the lead. Mm -hmm. Me take the lead. Oh, why? I'm sorry, I was under the impression I was in charge. Yeah, of course you are. You're leading and I'm following. Does that seem clear to you? Uh-huh. Clear as mud. Just make certain you keep your eyes open. Carlia is as sharp as a blade. Okay. The last thing I need is you blundering into a trap and warning her that we're here. question uh she thought that murder was more of the dark brotherhood's territory i have a long-standing arrangement with the dark brotherhood if i need someone in the guild taken care of we do it ourselves oh, okay we both agree it's best to keep these matters in house that works okay before we head in there how exactly did gallus die Twenty-five years ago, I was standing outside these very same ruins. Gallus told me to meet here, but he wouldn't say why. When I arrived, Gallus stepped from the shadows. Before he uttered a sound, an arrow pierced his throat. Before I could even draw my blade, her second arrow found its mark in my chest. Oh, jeez, so Carlia took care of both of you on her own. Carlia was a master marksman. And her greatest weapon was the element of surprise. I was lucky. She missed my heart by mere inches. I staggered away from the ruins and my vision began to blur. It's then that I realized the bitch had poisoned her arrows. And Gallus? The last thing I saw was Carlia dumping his body into an opening atop the ruins. An unceremonious end for a remarkable man. To this day, I've regretted allowing her to escape, even if it meant I had died trying. I owed Gallus that much. Okay. That's a story. Let's go get her then. And watch out for poisoned arrows and ice fates. Yeah, let's get in here before that ice fate sees me. So it begins. Uh, why not? 